Okay, so I came across this glycine actually when I was on, I think it was uh, Nomen Watch. I think that's how it's pronounced. Um, and wound up searching the internet a little bit and came across uh, the same watch being offered at um, Ashford. And there was some sort of discount. I don't remember exactly what it was, but, but I applied and, or should say, got the discount. And um, so I picked up this um, watch for, I think, somewhere in the neighborhood, like 340 bucks. Um, it's the uh, Combat Sub 42 Vintage. And... Um, might be kind of hard to see in the in the video, but um, has a textured, a little bit of a textured dial. Um, the date uh, window at the four o'clock, I'm not a huge fan of, but um, the date is actually red font. Um, so I thought that was an interesting touch. Um, 42 millimeter, 22 millimeter at the lug. Um, the loom is actually surprisingly good and um, I'll have a loom shot later on in the video um, it's got a you know flip and then the two pusher on the side which this seems there we go uh, you know milled not stamped uh, clasp uh, little etching or engraving on the case back nothing spectacular and uh, the bezel is actually uh, 60, not 120 click, 60 click. It's a little stiff. I just got this one. Um, not really not much play to speak of. I think it's more, well, little play, but not much. Really good. Um, sapphire. And uh, yeah, anyways. Uh, fits really good. It's got the curved lugs. I don't know what the exact lug measurement is. I want to say my wrist is, I don't know, somewhere in the seven and a quarter, but, uh, you can see it lays nice and flat. Oh, and I also didn't mention the, uh, bezel, uh, coin edge bezel and, um, yeah, really low profile. So anyways, I uh, hope you guys like it. Thanks. Bye.